good evening friends my name is atikur rahman and i am a aws certified devops engineer today i am going to show you how you can verify your aws uh, domain into aws acs so if you want to send uh, emails by aws acs it's a mandatory rule to verify your domain first and after that once this is verified you can only send emails using that domain name so aws acs is a very good platform for send <clears throat> large volume of uh, volume of emails and as you can see you can send up to 50000 emails per day that means uh, within a month it can be more than a million so if you, if you have a requirement to send around 50000 emails uh, you can use acs and that's a very reliable platform for sending large volume of emails so but to do this you have to first uh, verify your domain and then you need to apply for production access by default all your emails uh, acs are uh, put to a sandbox mode that means you cannot send more than 200 emails but if you apply via their support, so they will increase it up and they will set a limit minimum as a 50,000. And you can even increase further and set a new limit if you have any requirement. Okay, so uh, first I'm going to uh, click on the identities and then click here, click on domain, put my domain name here. This is the domain I want to verify. And then I'm going to click on uh, Easy Ticking. There is a new feature. It's called uh, Provide Dkim Authentication Token, but I'm just going to use the Easy Ticking. And the uh, Dkim signature key, RSA2048 bit. Publish DLS record, that's not needed. Dkim signature, set about. Okay, good. Then click Next. Okay, so here you have added your domain as an identifications uh, identities list. Then they will give you three uh, DNS records. So copy those DNS records and add into your domain. So if you have a DNS provider like Cloudflare, you can add the over there. Or if you are maintaining your domain in GoDaddy, Namecheap, or Hostinger, anywhere you are managing your domain, you just go there and add those DNS records. So I'm managing my domains using Cloudflare. So let's go to Cloudflare and then add those records into uh, this domain, sitesandshop.com. So click here, type C name, click on the name and then uh, copy value and then push here and then check uncheck the proxy. Save, similarly click here, click on add record, C name and then value proxy safe. Next C name, click here, copy the value. Okay, easy steps, very easy. You just do copy paste. That's it. You have added the three records. Now uh, wait for one or two more minutes. Maybe sometimes it takes five minutes or 10 minutes. Just have patience. And come back again when the DNS record is changes propagated. So usually it takes around five or 10 minutes. I'm going to pause the video and we'll come back to see if the DNS record is uh, propagated completely or not. Okay, welcome back. So I am uh, now back and I see the identity status is now verified. That means uh, I have verified this domain. And now using AWS uh, ACS, we can actually send uh, emails from this domain. Let's test, verify whether this is going or not. Uh, send test email. So from address like info, scenario, uh, we wanted to send a custom email so let's say um <clears throat> we wanted to send and then we want to set a subject uh, this is a acs very equation email body configuration set there is no special configuration set here so let's keep it as it is send Okay, and if I go to my mailbox, there it is. You can see uh, if you expand, it's sent as info at sitesandshop.com, but it's sent using AWS ACS. So you can see ACS 
that is the symbol. So that's uh, how we can use ACS to uh, verify your domain and then send emails from there. You can use Python, Node.js, or any other language and use their AWS SDK API to send emails. So that's it for today. I hope you like this video. If you like it, please subscribe to your friends and uh, share it with your network. Thank you. Bye-bye.